Hey there, everybody. So we're, the glare is gone, and it's and we we can get back to playing our game. And so, um, in the video before this, the, the glare just got really bad that I had to cut the third last thirty seconds of the video off, just because how bad the glare just got all of a sudden. And so, I'm not sure how much you actually can see up to this point where we're at now, but. Um, Kind of try and I'll just show you where we're at now. And so, let's get back into it. Hopefully we'll finish it soon. So, oh yeah, the lawsuit. Have to get a few things taken care of there. Yeah, there is no way I was going to win, because I had a couple things I forgot to turn back on. Louise's turn now. Spinning and... A six. A pay raise. Uh, suing other players. Oh, she's suing Reginald D and Chris. So that's one of my players and one of the computer players. So, gotta shake it again. Well, the other player won, so I have to pay some money to her now. Reginald D. Stern spinning, and what's it going to land on? A six. A payday. Collect a hundred thousand dollars for winning the Nobel Prize. Wow. Mark B's turn. We're spinning and what's it gonna land on? A three. A life token, pick a life token, select a player to take one from. And like I've said, if there's something where I have to pick a player to take something from, I always pick one of the computer players. So, just that's because I don't want to end up doing it to myself. So, and it's Chris's, and he landed on a nine. And Reginald Geek got some money from that because that's a long term investment spot. Oh, a pay raise for Chris and risky or safe path. Always choosing risky, which I would choose the risky as well because I feel like the risky, no matter which path you choose, either the risky or a safe path, you'll have pretty much the same result in the end. It's not like choosing one path is gonna is gonna like make you win or lose in the end. Louise's turn spinning and uh, 10. Oh wow. And Reginald D is the police officer, so Louise is pulled over and has to pay. And oh, and she has a payday, and, and then she retired. So now she's gonna retire at the Millionaire Estates with $50,000. Oh, 
Okay, now it's for the D's turn. Gonna spin. See where he ends up at. Um, a 10. And since he's also actually the police officer, he's not gonna end up pulling himself over and making himself pay. So, oh, now it's time to better, buy a better home. So since he was the one that was the police officer, if he wins on the 10, nothing happens. So. Okay, so a luxury mountain retreat is the one I'm picking. And spin. See what it lands at. Um a two. Oh, I landed on a pay day, or it's either a pay raise, I'm not sure. Oh, payday, alright. Mark B's turn. Got to spin. And see where it lands. A four. And he actually got some money because that was a spot he bought for the long term investment. Time to buy a better house. Okay. Buy a match, matching house pairs. There we go. Uh, $400,000 for the executive cape. And spinning. A three. payday and pay the taxes okay the Chris is turning spinning and a four a payday Spin the wind. Yeah, I don't. I always opt out because I feel like I'm. I it never lands on the spot that I choose, and so. Opt out and opt out and spin. And eight. Louise's turn. She's spinning, and what does it land on? And a four. And Mark B got some money from that. And oh yeah, she retired. She was the one that already retired, so she doesn't do anything else. So now it's, which I'm gonna stop it there, and actually, so it's not too long a video. And see you in the next video.